What's up guys, welcome to this video. In today's video I want to quickly show you how you can fix the issue if you're running into the error code Fall Guys missing files. That's the topic of today's video, so just stick around if you are interested in that. But before we start right into the topic, I would really like to mention something. You guys would certainly make my day if you could leave a like, comment and subscribe to my small little channel. It would mean the world to me, so thank you very much. But let's start right into the topic, what do you need to do in order to fix this issue. First of all, just open your Epic Games Launcher as you normally would and then uh, just also sign in. And then uh, head over to your library and click on the three dots at your Fall Guys installation and then click on Manage. And here, make sure to first of all turn on this auto update fu function here. Um, yeah, make sure to turn this on. And then at installation, click on this folder icon here um, right next to uninstall. And then make sure to find the Fall Guys underline client.exe. Right click on this application here, click on properties. And then change over to compatibility. And here uh, you need to make sure to set the following settings. First of all, try running this program in compatibility mode for set this setting here and then change to Windows 8 is perfectly fine. And then down here also uh, try disabling the full screen optimizations and try running this program as an administrator every time you launch it and then click on apply and if you're using uh, or playing Fall Guys on two or more users click on change settings for all users if not just click on ok and then um, yeah just uh, try launching Fall Guys again if it still did not work then follow the second step here uh, open your settings or no we can already head over to add or remove programs faster and then um, when this list with all of your programs loads up, type in EPIC and then you need to make sure to um, deinstall the EPIC online services. So just um, uh, on these three dots here, click on these and then just click on uninstall and click on uninstall. And then uh, just follow the, uh, the uninstallation steps and that's already it. That's how you can fix this issue. Really hope this helped you guys. If you've got any questions, just let me know in this comment section below. Then I'll write you back as soon as possible and we will surely find a solution. But that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you a wonderful day. See you in the next video. Bye.